This might be our fastest creature now. Who would have thought? A titanosaur. Flying titanosaur, bro. Jeez. What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome! Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved! That's right, we're playing here with Pugnacia Dinos, having so much fun doing flips! Man, oh man! Guys, how you doing today? Hope you're doing well. Me personally, I'm doing amazing. I'm having so much fun with this new Vulcan tech gear. Yes, I finally colored it up a little bit. Not sure if I'm going to keep it like this, but uh, yeah, this is it for now. Um, I also went in this morning. If you didn't know, last episode, we we're starting to breed up our spine breakers to get prepared for the ascension battle. And uh, yeah, I got uh, a couple of good eggs, a couple of good ones. Oh, crap. Where'd I? Where'd I put them? Uh-oh. Oh, 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 yeah. I put them over here. I put them over here so they'd be ready for us to hatch. Look at these beauties. We are up now to 186 in the melee. So pretty nice. Yeah. And I thought we could hatch out the next set of them together. So here it goes. We got both males and females. Oh, I always just love watching eggs get hatched out. And of course, these are from the Propagator. That's why they're all gold. And look at these beautiful spine breakers. I love them. All right, let's get these guys all packed up. And uh, one thing with the uh, the spine breakers, I've noticed sometimes the stats, even though it says they're a certain stat, it doesn't actually pass when I look at them. But let's see, 186. All right, so, so far, so good. Let's get them all tossed out. All right. Beautiful. Love it. Let's keep going. Very nice. And is this also... All right, two more. And bada boom. Oh, come on, come on. Bada boom. And finally, bada boom. Awesome. So that should be all of them. All right. Let's get them scooped back up. Boom, boom. All right. Beautiful. So we can get the next set going. So just have to confirm all the stats stayed. I don't know why it happened, but it definitely it definitely happened on uh, one set of them where it showed the stat, but it didn't actually pass. All right, so let's get this next set going. Do they all have? I think pretty much every stat is the same on them. So beautiful. We do have some more eggs too. These are ones that passed over things like health and stuff like that. So why don't we go ahead, grab all those out. And let's put in for the next set, yeah, one male, one female. Let's go ahead, prepare for breeding, start breeding, enable mating, and let's go ahead and get that going. All right, awesome. So we got our next set going. We're going to be looking for yet another boost into none other than melee. All right, awesome. Let's go ahead, throw the uh, extras that we have over here. Toss in those saddles. Oh, and I think I need to put in more element. I didn't want it to go like all night long. So I, I only left a certain amount of element in there. And then all the rest of them I just destroyed. I made an incinerator. Yeah, just to easily destroy the eggs. A little pain in the butt to eat them. But uh, anyway, well, that's going today. That's not the only thing going on. I thought maybe we could check out some of these other bosses. We still have Kareem's plant friend and we have the elemental titanosaur. So why don't we go and do another one of them? Let me go grab a sacrifice. Come on, come on. Beautiful. Just grab whatever random dragon that's left over from our breeding with the dragons. And let's see. Who should we do? Who should we do? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by his toe. If he hollers, let him go. Out goes Y O U. All right. Boom. Beautiful. All right. Let's try the Titanosaur today, guys. I think it should be pretty epic. And by the way, just want to remind you if you're enjoying this series, to show that amazing support by slamming that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, seriously, what are you waiting for? It is the perfect. Time to subscribe. Also, be sure to check out the Discord, be part of the Mac Pack, and definitely come hang out for the uh, daily live streams. 
Anywho, let's go. Let's go. Let's toss out our dragon. Awesome. And the sacrifice begins. Now, I think this is the largest of any of the creatures. Sacrifice. Come on, baby. Nice. Oh, beautiful, beautiful creature. Ooh, that actually feels pretty good. Oh, get out of here, things. What the crap? Look at that beautiful titanosaur. All right, so does it come with a saddle? It does. It does, in fact, come with one. Let's go ahead and pop it off, though, because once we put it on, there's a chance we won't be able to remove it. I don't know how the titanosaur works exactly. Actually feels really good. Let's go. Let's get an augment going on it. I think... Let me just see what this one actually costs to do an upgrade. Is this still filled with all that shenanigans? Um, I don't think we have anything in here. Okay, perfect. We should be able to just do the upgrade and see what it says. It might be crazy expensive. This is why I'm checking. And attempt upgrade. Yeah, look at that. Oh, that's crazy expensive. Now, because all the saddles on these guys get limited to 150, I think I can actually get there just through augments. So let's find out. Yeah, see? So much cheaper. All right, beautiful. Let's get a little bit of color in our life. Let's go with that. We'll just go black and red. Tribe colors. All right, beautiful. And nice. And awesome. We'll leave that stock. And yeah, we'll leave it like that. All right, awesome. Awesome, awesome. Next. Let's just see. Have we got any good ones yet? Because the second we get two good ones, all right, no. So let's go ahead and take those and incinerate them. Nope. And, oh, look at that. We got one. We got one. So I could, um, I probably should immediately go and hatch that one out and get it into the mix. All right. Awesome. Um, Let's go ahead and... Yeah, so it's the female. All right, cool. Let's grab, I guess, out the female. That will stop the breeding. Let's go ahead, toss it in here. Get that one ready. This is going to incubate the egg pretty instantly. It does it about once a minute. So let me get that handled. All right, awesome. Let's snag it and let's toss it out on the ground. Get this next one hatched. So we got to incrementally uh, come back, see what we get, and keep on replacing them. The goal is to get it wild up to as close as we can to 255 without actually hitting 255 in the melee. Um, Gimme, gimme. All right, let's toss back out. I'm not sure if they can breed when they're still considered a baby, so I always get them fully grown up. All right, perfect. Let's go ahead, toss her back in. Awesome. Prepare for breeding, start breeding, allow breeding, and let's get that going. All right, start breeding. Beautiful, we'll go check back in a bit. Anyway, uh, we can probably toss it. We get so many saddles, it's just ridiculous. Actually, you know what? These saddles are good <laughs> because you actually get uh, silica pearls, I think, from them. I, I believe they cost silica pearls. Not that we don't have enough, but anyway. All right. Love it. Let's go. Oh, we forgot to incinerate the other eggs. My goodness. All right. Um, Got to be careful that we don't over put them in. All right, because it will delete whatever you put in this inventory. All right. Awesome. I think those are my two original spine breakers, actually. Hold on. Don't want to get these confused. Nope. Nope. All right. Those were the parents that we had done previously. All right. Beautiful. Let's go see our titanosaur. Come here, buddy. All right. Let's get you a teleporter. Love it. Let's get you a keep folder. Love it. And should we imprint this guy right away? 
I don't know how we're going to... You know what? I think it will reach. I'm pretty sure it will reach. Let's go ahead. Whoa, what the crap? Wow. Um, I didn't realize this, but it gives you <laughs> everything that the... That's like everything. Jeez. All right, then. Um, let's get it real close over by the base, and I think I can do the imprint right away. All right. Come here, buddy. All right, and it should have reached it. That is so cool. All right, let's go ahead and pick it up, throw it back out just to refresh them. Okay, golden. Ooh, what is... Oh, is that the stuff that was in them? All right, fair enough. Now, I can't remember what Titanosaur eat. Is this guy going to be a meat eater or a berry eater? I would assume berry, but I guess we'll just find out as we go out. All right, very cool. Um, Let's also get our Bronto Turbo. Where's Turbo? Turbo! Oh, my God. I'm leaving everything inside. What am I doing? I like to empty out a lot of my inventory in between episodes just in case I like glitch through the floor or something. If you're holding everything that you own, that is not necessarily a good thing. All right, so that should be all the dinos and that guy. Oh, and we got to try out those uh, tech rifles. All right. We ready now? This is like whenever I go on vacation with me and my wife, we're just like keep on going back to the house because one of either me or my wife forgot something every single time. It, it happens at least like once for both of us. All right, where's Turbo? Come here, Turbo. Nice. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Turbo, where are you going? Let's see if we can do. Oh, crap. Jeez, Turbo. He's like, I don't like being up here. I'm afraid of heights. Silly guy. All right, here we go. Boom! Finally! Finally, finally. All right, what is the starting hits? Should we go after another Titanosaur right away? Why not? And... Ooh. Over 100,000 to boot. That is not bad. That is not bad at all. Let's see, this is the C. All right, that does a meteor shower. The right click. That does those spikes there. Yeah, he's not bad. Ooh. Um, probably get a lot of levels right here. Let's go ahead and do one of those and one of those. This guy is crazy high health. Gotcha! Get wrecked, bro. Yeah, I'm liking him already off the bat. Crazy strong. It's kind of weird. He doesn't have... Oh, no. Okay, X does... He doesn't really have a back foot stomp. You know, like a normal one would. So I'm guessing his radius of attack is much better than normal. Oh, crap. Who's hitting me? Get! Alright, now to check. Ooh. This guy... Does not eat meat. Crap. All right, we're going to have to get some berries. Going to have to get some berries. Look at my food. It is draining like crazy. All right, let's just get all these guys killed. This thing is ginormous. It's almost like difficult. I have no idea what I'm hitting. I'm just hitting everything. It's pretty cool, though. Definitely uh, doesn't despawn like a normal titanosaur. And big enough for you if you wanted to build a base on him. I would say this is probably the guy. If you're going to do base building on a Titanosaur, this is the one to do it. All right. What do we got? Dunka. Come on, Dunka. Dude, look at the resistance. That is insane. Keep on going. You got it. Wow. 820 Primal Dunka. All right, hopefully, yep, we are totally maxed out. Let me get those levels in, and let me get some food for him. Oh, my Lord. I might have made a big mistake. Um, I pumped a lot of movement speed into him. We are up to 845 movement speed, which is kind of nuts. Um, it was only about, like, 
five to ten boost. But anyway, um, we are max attack in four, five. Let's go the rest into that health. We're maxed out. I got berries for him. I just went off with turbo and, uh, you know, quickly completely. I got a crap ton of berries and like one, two swipes. But look at this. This is my walk speed. This is not my sprint. This is my walk. It is too insanely fast. This might be our fastest creature now. Who would have thought? A titanosaur. It is insane. Um, Let's see about... Oh, crap, it takes fall damage. Dude, look at this. Look at this. This, like, as I'm swimming. Are you kidding me, bro? This is nuts. This is absolutely insane nuts. All right. Not bad. Um, I would assume I can launch. I kind of am afraid, though, since I take fall damage. Why does this guy take fall damage? None of the others do. I don't know. Anyway, what do we hit for now? All right. 107. Not, not insanely good. I'll be honest. I was expecting a lot more. All right. I mean, that's with Bronto boost. Right? I'm getting Bronto boost. That's with uh, imprint. Oh my goodness, and let's go ahead and put the trophy on him now. All right, and... <laughs> so he does, he's not a hard hitter by any stretch. This is probably, may, like, at least thus far, the worst. What is this guy right here? Ooh, that's not a bad one. All right, let's try some of the big moves. Maybe these will redeem it if it actually hits anything. All right. Come on, hit the Mega P. It only hit him for a... Jeez! Come on. All right. We got... I mean, it does work. It does work. Maybe it's it's meant to be a speed demon. That's Maybe that's its deal, you know? That's just the walk. This is ludicrous. Imagine, like, having an entire base... And something that moves as fast. Oh, you're, you're coming to attack me? All right. Well, I'm just going to go across the map in a second. This is crazy. All right. Like, I launch just from, like, being in the water. It It's not even... This is so crazy. What is going on in the world? All right. Oh, crap. I'm, like, stuck. Okay, I was launching. Like, just from the water, I launch. Like, watch this. Like, right now, he's in a falling animation. He, he, this is too fast. All right. Uh, uh, I can't even control him. Flying Titanosaur, bro. Jeez. I'm, I'm going to kill myself with this fall damage. It is, it is too much. Thank goodness we have tech stuff now, so I'm not going to have to worry about it. Oh my lord. He just, he's always flying. He's like, I want to fly. What are you doing, bro? Absolutely killing me here. I just don't even know. It's too crazy. So I can always, there's a couple things I can do. I could dino mind wipe him. I mean, I kind of like the speed. It's kind of fun, but I could dino uh, mind wipe him and redo the stats, which I might do. But there's also things in Pug where I can put in... I think it's in the... Maybe it's in the costume slot that you can lower his speed. So that's another option, too. Without... If you don't have Dynamite Wipes or if you don't want to. Or, you know, sometimes you might want... You might want this speed. Yikes. You know what I was just thinking about? You know there's the one trophy that allows flyers to go into the water and still fly in the water and not dismount. It would be really cool if that same thing also allowed swimmers to fly. You know what I'm saying? Like, we get flying Moses up in here? That would be incredible. Oh, man. Because I haven't even bothered with most of the Moses. Because there's just no reason. Alright. Um, I'm going to say already... Um, I'm not, I am not going to take on the Tempest with this guy. No, not at all. I, I can barely handle walking. Oh my Lord, dude, you're, you're just too fast. 
All right, so here's the elemental titanosaur. You can see why I was not thrilled about using them, but it still is cool. It still is cool. It gives us all that crafting shenanigans as well as, um, you know, it'd be decent for if you wanted to live on the back of them. Dude, imagine if we put the hanger. I mean, look at how big he is. He couldn't even fit in the hanger. I mean, maybe he could. I don't know. But I wonder if you... I bet you could. I bet I could put maybe a smaller hanger, but put a hanger nonetheless on his back. That would be so cool. That would be crazy laggy, though. All right, so there we go. Elemental Titanosaur. Let's go uh, pop back in. Get out of here, Chairbird. I see you. Don't think I don't. Let's go pop back in and see how our spine breakers are doing. All right, we are back. Let's see if we got another mutation in the melee. And I think let's scoop up all the eggs that we do not want to keep. Nope. And nope. And nope. All right, we got 206. All right, we got our first one. All right, very cool. Let's keep on going. I'm going to leave the ones that have health too, just in case. Another 196. Beautiful. All right, get out of here. That's a health one. 206. Not bad. Nope. And nope. And nope. 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 206. Beautiful. We got a bunch of them. All right. We can definitely do another hatching session. All right, get out of here. We'll keep on, we'll hold on to that. I'm not gonna even bother hatching it though. All right, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Let's go ahead, stop breeding, love it. Let's go ahead and destroy all these eggs. Because the reason I'm doing this, every time when I wanna eat it, it's like, are you sure? Yes, and I gotta keep on doing that every time. So, boom, gone. Gone to the world. All right, so let's go ahead and grab all the 206s is what seems to be the best. So no, no, 206, 206, 206. All right, beautiful. I want to make sure that we can get that melee tip top and then I'll probably backtrack and if we can, and then go ahead and work on health. All right, awesome. Let me hang out here. And I'll see you back when they're ready to hatch. All right, they're ready. Two males, two females. Not bad. Let's get them all tossed out. Golden eggs. I love these golden eggs. I wish they were a little bigger, though. Isn't that cool? All right, and... Ooh, do we get a twins in there? I think we might have. All right, let's get them all scooped up. Get all those saddles too. Beautiful. And let's find out who the new breeding partners are going to be. So let's take out the current parents. Awesome. And let's see. So let's line up females and males. So yeah, it looks like we might have got a, a. Did we get a double set of twins? I think we did. So they should all be identical 206, 206, 206. All right, awesome. So I think we're gonna go, it doesn't really matter. Uh, let's see, what has the lower number? Oh crap, we're getting high on mutations. Now that I look at this. We might not have done this the best way possible, but it is what it is. Golden, golden, golden. Um, Next up, what should we do? You know what, I'm gonna wait for another session. I wanna take out one of these guys. We're already at 206. Pretty soon, I want to take one out and start trying it out and get it leveled up. So I think that should be pretty cool. All right. It took a while, but we got another mutation in the melee. Beautiful. Let's grab that one. Let's go ahead, grab the parents. All the rest of them can get grinded up. All right. Beautiful. Put them in the incinerator. Come on, come on, come on. Awesome. And our one good egg. Let's incubate it. We'll hatch it. Rinse and repeat. Once I get to, if I get to max mutations, which we might already be at, 
Um, all I got to do is grab one of the parents, the original pair, which have zero mutations, let them breed, and then we'll get one side that should say zero mutations again. So, yeah, pretty, pretty good. Okay, good to go. And, bada boom. Let's go, Spinebreaker. So, bro breaking 200. That is what's up. Oh, and we got triplets. You gotta be crapping me. All right. Beautiful. And when you get triplets, is it, are they always one gendered or can you get a male and a female? This I do not know. All right, that should be all of them. Just double check that it didn't throw out the wrong one. All right, beautiful. Let's get them picked back up. Very cool. And let's go ahead, throw the female back in. We'll throw the male back in. So look at that, 216. Doing so good. All right, and prepare dinos for breeding. Start breeding. All right, love it. And... Five, start breeding. All right, cool. Let's see what we get. Holy crap, that took a while, but we finally got it. Look at that, 226. All right, moving up in the world. Got maybe two more times that I want to do it. Let me see. So 26, 36, 40. Yeah, 46 is probably a good enough number. 56 would be too high. So let's go ahead, let that go. Let's grab all the eggs. All right. And should be the only things in this folder. Adios. Oh, I would be devastated if I did a wrong transfer there. I'm just waiting for it to happen. I feel like it's going to eventually. Imagine if I threw like all my dino soul balls in there. Oh, that would be so bad. That would be absolutely devastating. Oh, I normally don't use that thing just, just for that reason. All right, here we go. Spine breaker. Now, this might be at the point because we got a female. It might be at the point that uh, we have to switch back to breeding with some other guys. We'll see. I got to do some testing with it. All right, fully grown. Beautiful. Because I think the parent that we're replacing it with, this is the one that didn't have full mutations. This one does. Oh. All right. Um, let me grab. It takes longer and longer when you don't have matching stats. So we have a female. Do we have a male that's not maxed out? All right. I could do it with this one, I suppose. Yeah, we'll do this one this time. All right. Beautiful. Let's take the two oldies, put in the two new ones. Bada boom and bada boom. This one's going to be, we have to make sure that we get the mutation from the female in order to pass. That's why it takes so long. All right. Prepare for breeding. Start breeding. Allow breeding. And good. Female. All right. Every single egg cost me, I think it's seven element. It adds up. We had, I think, 10,000 elements to start the day. So anyway, I'll see you back once we get the next one. Holy crap. We officially did it times two. Yeah, look at that. Another one popped out before I was able to uh, to stop it. I am pumped, guys. I am super pumped. All right, let's get these ones out. That means one of them, if we want to, we can uh, we can take out and uh, play around with while they're continuing to breed. Um, we're going to work next on trying to get a melee. Or excuse me, a, uh, a health. All right, so eggs. Bada boom and incinerate. Bada boom. Man, it's so funny when it, when it turns nighttime. I, I usually don't record at night, but uh, the lights get so much brighter. It is absolutely obnoxious. All right. Our two new spine breakers. And... 
Bada boom! So this is, I could go higher, but it's going to take a different type of breeding because if I add 10 onto it, it's, uh, it's going to get kind of crazy. All right, there's our two new babies. Love it. Let's toss them out. And both of them, two, four. Oh, these guys are going to be so strong. All right. Um, I'm going to do a little bit more breeding until morning arrives. And uh, maybe we get even better before then. But we'll have to see. So, um, yeah, I'll meet you right back. And let's go out on our mega spine breakers. All right, the day has arrived, and over the night, I was able to get up to 161 in the health, along with that 246. But you know what? I was being silly. I don't have to do five uh, mutations. If I just did four, it's basically uh, in, in vanilla, you'd get mutations two at a time, two points. So it's multiplicative. Basically, if you put five boosts in, that's five times two, that's 10, and that's what we're getting. Well, if I put in four boosts instead, four times two is eight, which is exactly what we need to get to 254. So that now, if we go to 255, a mechanic and arc will not allow you to uh, level up your dino. It, it will just freeze. It'll get stuck there. It's so weird. And if it goes to 256, it rolls back over to one again. So, eight, 254 is the magic number, if you didn't know. So, I got it. It does not have the higher health, though. So, I might go a little bit further, but I just wanted to point that out. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go all out. I'm going to keep on doing this, guys, for you so we can get the Mega Spino today. All right. I think we are finally finished. I've been doing this for hours, all day. I mean, you can look at how low our element is now. Like how many I, we may have gone through oh, like approaching 5,000 element just to get this. But let me show you. Oh, we got 253 in the health and 254 in the melee. And then I went for the extra stamina boost in this one. 404 14 <laughs> mutations on both sides of the parents. That is nuts absolutely insane I, I probably could work on doing the stamina even higher but honestly i don't care that's good enough we have a pair we can breed them indefinitely oh my lord what a long day this is why once i get into these breeding rabbit holes ugh, i just i don't want to stop until i'm finished but you know just so i can wrap it up that day but holy crap what a long day it can be this better be worth it though. So let's hatch out our pair and let's level one of them up and see how amazing is this going to be what we use for the final ascendant fight. And do we need to breed up scorpion, the scorpion guys, the scarbers or the tempest or something else? I don't know. We'll find out. Here we go. Let's toss out them eggs. I've got saddles for both of them. Oh, this is going to be basically for a spine breaker, the best you could possibly get more or less, you know, minus stats like weight and things that do not matter for battle. All right, let's get them packed up. Let's toss them back out. And you know what? Let's just go ahead and take just for now one of them. That is good enough for me. It's already imprinted. Toss on that saddle. Get that keep folder and get in that teleporter all right so moment of truth how insanely good is this guy gonna be i do not know it better be hitting for over that million that's all i have to say all right so starting hit this is without using the uh i stole my fister thing okay good i haven't lost it yet all right so what are we gonna get 222,059. That's up there. That is definitely up there. Let's go ahead and get in. Where is it? Where do I keep it? Bada bing, bada boom. All right, let's get you maxed out as quickly as possible. And let's try and take on a big boy boss with it. Come here. 
Wow. This guy is not bad. It's actually hitting harder. We're hitting... I didn't boost anything, and it's hitting for now two something. These guys are probably boosted. Oh, half a million to boot. And it might have been mate boosted, too. That is nuts. That is totally nuts. All right, what do we got? Already there. Let me get it in. All right, last 10 levels. One, two, three, four, five for max attack. And as you can see, we've already cleared a million. 1.3 million. And will this now be our strongest creature? Let's find out. Come here, buddy, bro. Oh, 937,000. Yeah, I'm, I think this is our strongest. You may be saying to yourself, but DMAC, you got a bunch of guys that hit for over a million. Well, yeah, but that's after you put this in. We haven't even put it in yet. So now with that in, oh my lord. So now it is stronger than anything else by a good 200,000. I think our Skarm hits for... 200,000 less than this, but we still have this, which now hits twice for 3.5 million. Yeah, plus all the other residual damage. That's a lot. That is a real lot. So let's, uh, let's see how much actually is that? Come on, buddy, bro. Smash! All right, bubble. Let's go, bro. Look at how quickly we're melting him. That is crazy. Come on. Oh! And look at our health. I'm not even close to having to use a health potion yet. All right. All right, bubble. Trouble. My God. This thing is monstrous. And we have an unlimited army of them. Good God. Destroyed the Tempest. Like, absolutely annihilated them. That is so epic. We can get an army of these guys to take on the Ascension bosses. That is sick. Now, we still could breed the Skarmory. Or the... Not Skarmory. The, uh, the Scorpion. We could still breed them. And he likely would bite for quite a bit more than that. I think it just has a higher base attack. But this special move is where it's at for huge damage. So it does take a little bit of accuracy. But yeah, I am pleased. We have the Mega Spinebreaker. Yes, an army of them. So yeah, I think we're good, guys. I think we are good. Oh, but on that note, it was a long day, so I think it is now time to go through those comments. All right, guys, I just finished going through the comments, and yes, it is now that time. That's right. Time to name the dinos. For those of you that do not know, at the end of every single episode, I go through the comments of the previous episode and I pick out all the most awesomest name suggestions that you guys leave in the down there. That's right. Just remember, if you want to have a chance of getting your name chosen, you got to be a subscriber. So smash that subscribe button and yeah, just comment down below it is just that easy anyway for today we have yes our spinebreaker from yesterday our original original one to start this whole breeding project with and our second skarner so without any further ado we have sting love it and bubbles very cool the wifey of shadow ball Love it, guys. For next episode, we need to come up with names for our best two Mega Spine Breakers. Yeah, is good. They can't get any stronger. This is the strongest they can possibly get. So for our two Spine Breaker and 
for, don't forget, the elemental titanosaur. So help me out, guys. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Seriously, it's been a pleasure as always. Show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, please do not forget to subscribe for the Daily Arc awesomeness. And as always, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks again and peace. Ow!